six things women check before they decide to do the deal with you. They check this before they go down with you. Before they say, okay, it's your cucumber that I want. I want to have this cucumber to myself. I want to keep it for myself. I want to have it. I want it to be for myself. They will check this. They will check these six things to make sure, look, you have these six things, so then they will now do the deal with you. They have to check it. Most of them, not all women do that, but majority of women will want to make sure that all these are intact so that when they are ready to do the do it, there will be no any, any regrets because they want to also continue to do the do with you. So number one thing that any woman will check before they do the do is the size of your joystick. There are some women that prefer the middle one and there are some women that will prefer the bigger one. And there are also some women that don't like the bigger, like when they think extra large. But there are women that like the extra large, they want the big. So every woman will want to check. They will not ask you to, okay, pull off your, 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 this thing for them to see, that's your clothes, for them to see if the do is actually um, big or is what they want. They will be used, you know, descriptively method. They will use like, they'll be very smart. They wouldn't want you to notice that they are checking it out. They will first of all use their eyes to look at the dandelion in between your leg to see if they can kind of, uh, you know, imagine it. When they see they are not seeing it, they will start doing things that will kind of make it, you know, come up. You will see them sit on your lap. They will come and sit on your lap, not just to sit on your lap. You see, then they will sit on your lap and they will be dancing all this shaking dancing. Like this, like this. You would think it's just dancing. You know, she will dance. Maybe there's music playing at the background. You see her dancing to that while she's shaking. Uh, uh, she, she's on top of your lap, right? And she will be shaking it. So you'll be like, why is she dancing this kind of dance? And this kind of dance makes you... You know makes the cucumber to to kind of wake up and become active so she's trying to use her backside to feel it to make sure that look this is working when she do all that you see her also she will use tight to touch your chest you know those things in your chest she would just try to press them both of them she'll touch it to see if you we kind of feel something so she will do all that to see if the in between your leg is active when in between your leg is not active, it will not stand. But if she keep doing it and this in between your leg is not standing, that the cucumber is not standing, she'll be like, oh, this man is not active. So she wants to check if your, and to check the size of your cucumber, she has to like make you, make you feel. So I start feeling somehow to make the cucumber stand. So when the cucumber stand, then you see her hugging you, she will turn back and hug you all those organ she will make sure she press her body very close to you and she will make sure she feel it with her body she want to feel you in between your legs to make sure look this is what i want so when you see a woman doing all that you know she's just being uncomfortable around you she will touch you she will use she will hug you she will touch you your chest she will touch you she will try to hug you she will try to sit on uh, on your lap and then dance you see but you see her even if she's not sitting on your lap you see her using her backside to working for you she will using her backside to touch your cucumber she will be shaking her backside her backside will be touching your cucumber she will be not be using it to take she's trying to you know make it active so when the thing is active she want to feel if this is what she want to be enjoying number two thing a woman will check to know if she want to do the do with you and especially if she want to do the do and continue to do the do with you she will check if you are married she doesn't want both of you to do just one night nice stand or you know women regret it when they do one night nice stand just one night nice stand with you and then you you kind of dub them they feel somehow a lot of men feel somehow so they want to know if you are married because if you are married they wouldn't want to go down with you because they want to have the cucumber with them especially when they they check all those things and see that you have something they will start checking to know if it's gonna be for them so they wouldn't want to start doing anything with you they will first of all check you see them asking you 
I know your girlfriend will like it so much. I know you are. She'll be saying things for you to just tell her, look, I'm not married, though. I'm single. Hey, your girlfriend must be enjoying you. Oh, your wife. So if you don't say all those things, why she's, she's just psyching you to see if you're married because she wants to do the do and still keep you that is doing the do. She doesn't want to be side chicken. So when she see that, look, you are single, then she will, the next one, she will start asking, she wants to come and visit you. No woman wants you to take her to a hotel, you know, where she will just do one and then you ask her, oh, go. So she wants to continue to do the do with you. She wants to go and investigate your house. She wants to see if your house is good, where she can feel comfortable when you guys are doing the do. The do. So men want you to do it in the kitchen. She wants you to carry her to the room the palo. So, if you are staying with somebody or you are living in a place where they share apartment, she don't want that kind of place because she doesn't want to stock, be stuck in the room. She wants you to take her to kitchen and do the do. She wants it when you guys start so that the thing will be hot, 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 hot. She wouldn't want you to just stop at the room, every time in the room. She, she will check if you are living with your family because if you are living with your family, let's say your parents, she will not feel comfortable because when she starts doing the do and she starts screaming like, ah! Those screaming that she's screaming, she said, Ha, ah, ah, ha, daddy, mo, daddy, mo, all those screaming. Your parents will say, What is going on? So she won't feel comfortable. So she wants someone to know if you are staying alone. If you are staying alone, she will take it. Oh, this is what I want. I want a man that stayed alone. So that's one of the things she wanted to stay alone. And again, if you stay in a place where the landlord is, you know. The house is uh, join, join, join. You see how she also feel very uncomfortable because she wants a place where she can shout, move, hoo, 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 hoo. you know, do all those sound. When she do all those sound, nobody will, nobody will stop her. Nobody will like knock on the door and say, "Is everything all right?" So she wants to make sure that everything is all right. So she come and do survey in your house. That's when she survey, finish and see that look, this is where we'll be doing the do. The kitchen is cool. You are staying alone. So we do it in the kitchen, in the parlor, everywhere, everywhere we'll be doing the do. She'll be like, okay, okay, this is it for me. This is the this man is for grab. She will not grab you. So she will now move to the next point, which is number four. Number four point, when she have checked all that, we see her trying to initiate kissing. She'll try to see if she can just touch you, you know, try to see. She will first of all initiate it. When a woman starts initiating, you know, start pecking you, from there she moves to your lips, you will know that, look, there is something she's up to. And when you try to touch her down there, she'll say, no, she's trying to check you to know if your game is on, if you know how to Oh, not like this. You bite her like this. You know, there are some people when they hold it, they will draw it. They will, they will draw in it like that. You'll be like, what is going on? She wants to know if you know how to do it. You know, you just So when she sees that you know how to do all that, you know, you, 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 you are good with your. She will take it good and then she'll move to the next step, which is the foul pay. She wants to know if you know how to touch her the right places. You know when to touch her the right places so that she will just be doing you know, you know the way they twinkle somebody like you touch somebody. She wants to know if you know how to do those things. When you touch her the right places, those sensitive places that you touch her, she will just do she will just surrender. Ha -ha! She will also find out if you know how to do that. So when she sees that you know how to do that, oh, you know how to touch her and what will we do that? She'll be like, oh, you know, you will see her just saying, oh, she will just submit. So she will check all those things. If she sees he doesn't know how to do it, huh? that's not good. But when she sees, oh, that once you touch her, she just fall yakata, yakata, yakata. And give up and say, Oh, I surrender my I surrender. So when she see that she can surrender like this, ah, she move to the next step, which is the dominating. She wanna see not just that you are the king, 
but a king that know how to perform his duty, his responsibilities. When she see that you are not just a king, but a king that have authority and know how to exhibit that authority. Oh, she like it. She like it when you dominate. She will start with if you know how to lift her up. She will and lift her up and you know still hold her for a long time because that's. She's trying to check if when you are doing the do, you will also do the do for a long time. So if you if you lift her up, she will, you will see her dancing. She not just lift her up like this, like like how do I say? You just lift her up, oh, just lift her up like this. You know, she will be standing as if they are forcing you to do that. You know, you know the way you grab her, you hold her behind, and um, you know how you grab her and hold her behind lift it up your hand is on her behind then her leg will wrap around your your waist that's what i mean your why your hand is there going at the behind not the one you hold her you hold her here and jump out like as if you are lifting a baby doesn't make sense so these are the things she will check. So if she see that you know how to grab her, and then you know you are while she's there, her leg are wrap, you are now doing her. She's feeling something, she, and you are you you do that for a long time. She be like, ha, ah, this is it. This is my last bus stop. Oh, you see the way I'm saying it. Oh my God. So when you she do that, she also turn her back to see if you can lift her from the back. Not still lift her from back like a, a stick. <laughs> No, she want to see if when you lift her up, you know, you can bend her, not straight bend, you know, then she will now use her back to wrap you, uh, her, her leg to wrap your back. So these are the things she want to see if it's not only the, you know, missionary style that you know how to do. She'll be like, oh, it's the only the missionary. So she's trying different style. And you see, maybe you guys will just say, maybe she's preparing something. She'll just call you in the kitchen. Then when you come in the kitchen, she'll be like, oh, oh, she'll not jump on you. Or you say, oh, lift me up. If you, if you see, you know, if you are saying, no, I'm tired. She'll know that, look, you'll be tired when the baby do is doing. So you're the type that is always tired. But when, when she say, lift me up, she's trying to check if, when you guys, maybe she's cooking in the kitchen and you just come in, if you can, if you're the type that likes to do it in the kitchen. So she want to test all those things. So she's trying to test your dominating. And um, if you are doing, when you start doing with in between your, the thing in between your leg, if you doing it, if you will stay and do it, for a longer time that's what she's trying to check so if she see that you can do it for a longer time and you can dominate not just dominate be in charge you you will push her to the wall gently and while you are doing the do she'll be like ha ah, this is it for me this is it for me you see her she will just submit and the do will start that's it king so when she want to do the do with you to check for all this you might not know she's checking them, but when she see her acting, oh, carry me off, lift me off, do this, she's trying to see if your game is on point, if your in between your leg is active. So if she notices that in between your leg is active, oh, she will say, this is the king for me. I'm going to see you king. I'm going to see you win. Bye.